Good afternoon, beautiful people. How are we doing today? Welcome back to Hand in Hand Together. Hope you've been enjoying the meditations in the videos lately um, and kind of, you know, taking some notice of your well being. If so, please share them about. Um, let's get these out into the world and, and get as many people as possible into our nice little community. Um, so, today I want to talk about one of the first words that we learn in our lives no. The word no. When you're a youngster, it seems quite easy to say no, doesn't it? It comes quite easy, especially to your parents. No, not doing it. No, don't want it. Yeah, but as adults, for some reason, we kind of fall into a trap of not using it quite as often. So this week, I want to talk about us saying no to stuff. More. No to things more, no to people more. Yeah, and um, it's so easy to fall into the trap of saying yes for loads of crap that we're just really not interested in doing or that we know we shouldn't be doing. Yeah, so the, the basis of a lot of the times that we say yes in situations or to people um, when actually what we really want to say is no is because we're looking for um, their reaction to us saying yes. So we're looking for... Um, our self-worth to be praised and, and, and raised up by other people um, you know and it, it just doesn't work it kind of always comes back it's a bit like um, it's a bit like the overeater and this is a metaphor that I understand quite a lot who goes into the kitchen half hour half hour after they've had their dinner and makes themselves a sandwich and for that five minutes you're making it and eating it you're quite excited and you get that buzz and you're feeling quite good about it and energized and all them toxins and, and chemicals get released and then 10 minutes later you're like ah oh, you idiot what are you doing that for and you get all critical and your self-worth goes back to where it was before and that's the same with saying yes to people in situations that you don't really want to say yes to so you say yes um to, to someone and they oh thank you for that thank you and you know, your, your self-esteem and your self-worth gets risen a little bit because someone's giving you a bit of a pat on the back. Um, but then 10 minutes later when they've gone, you're like, I really don't want to do that. Why did you say yes? And like all that critical voice starts again. And, and so your self-worth comes back down. Yeah, so we may think that saying yes to people in situations all the time that we're not really interested in is good for us and good for our self-worth, but actually in the long run, it has the opposite effect. So I want you to kind of understand that saying no is okay. Uh, other people's reactions to you saying no is not your responsibility. Uh, your responsibility is to your well-being. Um, now I'm not saying say no to everything. I mean, there will be situations where you, we do stuff that actually we're not completely keen on. I'm talking about the extra level. I mean that extra level of just saying yes all the time because you don't want to upset people, because you think other people are more important than you, um, or because you're looking for, for some recognition on a pat on the back, or you're feeling a bit low about things and you're thinking saying yes will kind of raise that because someone will appreciate it. Um, no, no, it's a short term hit and you end up in this cycle of having to say yes to everything because you don't feel good without the recognition from the other side. You know, it's like overeaters, you go back for another sandwich, you get that high. You know, say no to the sandwich. Say no to the sandwich of life. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, it's good for you, so try. And recent videos have been about kind of, you know, you breathe in and, and sitting with your thoughts. Sorry about the smoke, but I've got a fire right next to me. Um, sitting with your thoughts, being okay with your silence. And when you're faced with things that you don't really want to say yes to, put them into place, sit back, have a think of them thoughts. Do you know what I mean? Why am I saying yes? Do I really want to do this? Do you know what I mean? And, and say no. Um, and, it, and if people aren't used to that, which they won't be if you've always said yes all your life, they'll get used to it. You know, people that care about you and want the best for you, if you're doing what's the best for you, for your own self-worth, they'll always be by your side. And if people get the ump and, and bugger off because you say no to them, you probably don't want them around anyway because they're not very good for your self-worth. Yeah, you see the cycle? So this is about, I just want you to become aware of the amount of times you say yes in your life every day or every week to things that you don't really want to do. Um, and this might be 
with yourself, it might be with people, it might be at work, it could be with particular situations. Yeah, so it's not just external, we, we look, it's not just people, sorry, it's objects, like the sandwich. The sandwich is gonna make me feel good. Well, yeah, for a little bit, but not for long. Yeah, no, say no. Um, you know, you don't have to be an arse about it. <laughs> you know what I mean, we're not horrible people, so you can say no, you don't have to, uh, what's the word? What is the word? Justify you saying no, but there is nothing wrong with just saying, no, I don't really fancy doing that, or no, I haven't got time to do that, or no, I'm too busy at the moment, or no, it doesn't interest me, yeah? That's okay, that's all you need to say. You don't need to go into this big justification of why you're saying no to somebody or situation, yeah? so. My tip for this week is put the previous chats that we've had, yeah, about reaching for your own stars and noticing your thoughts and becoming more connected to you and your own well-being. Yeah, you, the only place you can build your self-worth up is, is in here. Yeah, because if your self-worth is attached to anything external, you're, you're at risk of that being taken away all the time. If you can build it up in here, it's up to you then. You keep it or you give it away. Yeah, so the more our lives are dependent on external resources for our self-worth, the more risk our happiness and our self-esteem is at. Yeah, so start in here. Start to say no a little bit more and be okay with it. So don't say no and then criticise yourself. Yeah, or, or react to how the other people are reacting because you've said no. That's their stuff. Let them go and sit with their thoughts and work out why that's so difficult for them. Okay, this is about you, all right? So spend some time, grow your awareness, get off autopilot and notice when you're saying yes too much, yeah? Because a lot of times it will be an automatic autopilot response. Do you want to come here this weekend? Yeah, 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 if you like. You won't even have given it a second of thought, yeah? You're so used to saying yes to everything that it just comes out. Yeah? So we need to step back, slow down, get conscious, get off that autopilot and start saying no for your own self-worth. Does that make sense? Yeah, it does work. Yeah, it does work. It takes practice uh, and it takes being able to sit with the uncomfortableness of putting a different um, reaction into your life, but it is well, well worth it, trust me, okay? So uh, there's plenty of other meditations that will help you with that confidence level of of being able to get to that point of saying no a bit more. So, you know, subscribe down the bottom. Um, there's lots of videos on there that, that can help you with this process of getting to that point where you're creating your own self work. It's a magical place to be, okay? Um, spread the word, you know, if you know people are struggling, uh, send them a link to, to Hand in Hand Together because there's lots and lots of stuff on there that's really helping people become the superhero of their own lives, which is what it's all about really, isn't it? Do you know what I mean, having your own powers, it's amazing. Um, so yeah, if, if you've got any questions about this topic of saying no, then um, please ask them below. Um, it's a perfect place to start a conversation. Uh, and if you haven't subscribed, click subscribe, press the bell so that you get notifications for uh, whenever I upload new videos. Okay, so thank you. Take care of yourself. Have a good week saying no. Namaste.